Friends, this weekend we celebrate the 107th Migrant and Refugee Sunday. In his message for this year's Sunday, Pope Francis calls us towards an ever wider we, towards breaking down the walls that separate us and building bridges instead that foster a culture of encounter between us. Some of you might remember some 18 months ago now when Pope Francis delivered his Ubi et Orbi message inside an empty St. Peter's Square at the beginning of the pandemic. There, standing alone and yet united with the world in prayer, the Holy Father encountered for us that dramatic scene of the disciples at sea with waves and wind raging all around them. They were afraid and they sought the help of Jesus who simply uttered the words, peace, be still. It's a powerful image and one that rings true for us today as we continue to live through this global pandemic. Pope Francis reminds us that in this time of fragility, we're all in the same boat and everyone's important and needed as we row together out of this crisis. As Christians, we're called to respond to the calls of our brothers and sisters in need, offering them a sense of gospel hope and of goodness. I'm especially mindful at the moment of the people of Afghanistan, who over the years and in these last couple of months have had to once again flee their homes and leave behind their families and loved ones to start afresh. In their suffering, they've had so much to teach us by the way of their grace and their perseverance and lived experiences. They are present for us. I'm grateful here in our Archdiocese, which is one of the most culturally diverse in Australia, that we continue to be blessed with the unique gifts and experiences that you, our migrant and refugee communities, offer. As you know, we'd hoped to gather today with uh, your various communities for our Sunday Eucharist and celebration and a rosary here in St. Patrick's Cathedral. But given our current circumstances, we will have to save this for another time. And so on this Migrant and Refugee Sunday, let us continue to pray for one another, to hold each other up to the Lord, that we may see beyond our differences and instead work towards building communities of hope, a hope that stems from Jesus Christ, that even now in the midst of all of our struggles, continues to speak to us with those comforting words, peace, be still. My prayerful blessings to you all.